The US has now recorded more than a million COVID-19 cases. Hospitals overstretched, the number of dead soaring. What can they do in the US? Quarantine. That's the only answer. People buying bread, hand sanitizer. Bigger problem, which is a fear pandemic. This is a war all into itself, and it's a, it's a terrible thing. Now, let me just share this. We're all afraid to catch in coronavirus, and we don't want our loved ones to catch it. But let me tell you something, fam. There is a virus worse than the coronavirus. There is a virus that's worse and more contagious than COVID virus, and that's called the virus of sin. You know, they say the symptoms of coronavirus is you get a cough, you get the chills, you get respiratory breathing problems. Symptoms of a sin virus is loneliness, depression, confusion, brokenness, isolation. But the root cause of it is called sin and separation from God. I got good news for y'all. There's a vaccination for this virus. All across the world, doctors and researchers and hospitals are coming together. Find the vaccine, find the vaccine. People are volunteering themselves to be injected with potential cures of COVID-19 so that we can have the vaccination. Did you know that Jesus volunteered himself to cure us from the sin virus? Jesus was sinless. Jesus was perfect. And Jesus says, hey, God, I need to go there. I got the vaccination. The Bible says he who knew no sin became sin so that he can cleanse us, so that he can heal us, so that he can forgive us of the punishment of sin. I want y'all to hear me. There is a cure for your loneliness. There is a cure for your brokenness. There is a cure for the things you're going through. And that's why Jesus says here, he who believes in me does not come into judgment, but has passed from death to life. So who is Jesus? Jesus says he is God. What does Jesus offer us? He offers us eternal life. And here's my last question. I'm going to say this. How should we respond? Only proper response is to do what he told us. To worship him. To honor him. That all may honor the Son. Just as they honor the Father, they ought to honor me.